elephant. What we're going to do is take it from the top here today. Thank you, everyone, for being a part of this show. We have a redemption from Splat Cake of the Elephant Cannon, and I love this. It's one of the items in this game that I absolutely adore. It's an epic. It's a lot of power score. There's a lot of durability, and it also has a lot of mass. It's quite heavy, this thing. So with the elephant, let's have a closer look at some of its features. This cannon is an absolute beast. You don't see it so often these days i'm not exactly sure what it's kind of like a mid-range sort of competitive tier build if you want to get into it but why have one of these when you have typhoons and tsunamis to choose from well the thing with this as a turret you're going to have a lot of durability and also the 360 rotation offered by the turret means it's great in those sticky situations when you're at medium to close range and need to get into a bit of a brawl And with this myself, I love the turret because it has a lot of durability. Also, look at its perk, which is that after the shot, the weapon's resistance to all types of damage will increase by 20% for 4 seconds. So it's almost uh, a little reminiscent of the breaker perk. They're obviously not as good, but it's strong and it will stay on your build. And it's not as likely to get one shot as some of the other heavy turret cannons that are on the, the market. With this, yes... Alright guys, fucking, we're going to take a closer look at how I like to get this turret together, and I have my tactical tank, which is available, which is available to you on the exhibition as I speak, and the way, I, the configuration I have with this at the moment is that it pairs really well with the barrier and the added durability of these tracks to absorb all those sudden impacts from your opponents. And these are, in my opinion, I believe are pretty cheap at the moment. These are going pretty cheap at the moment, and I'm tempted to buy another one to pair these up with a flywheel and a dead man's cab. <sighs> Looking at the price for this item, yes, it is going for the lower side of 2.5k which almost makes it affordable to some of the players that have been around for quite a while. It also pairs well with a dead man's cab if you're brave and a flywheel to, to make it absolute filth. This cannon can be destructive to say the least and it's going to hang around to see the end of the game. I recommend it. You're going to see some games with me in this as well as some funds with scorpions later on. Thank you for reviewing this with me. Everybody do... 